Hi, I'm Brian Blake for Shaper E Movement and Track Coach Wilson, North Carolina, with some tips on how to jump a little higher, a little bit better. For this clip, you will need good shoes or spikes, a hurdle, and a track. Some very easy things that you can do in the weight room, squats, lunges, and even cleans. There are variations of each one that your coach should be able to show you. Squats, whether you're doing a regular squat or a jump squat, is very power oriented. And that will really help train your body on how to explode up. The Olympic lifts, like the snatches, the cleans, things like that, go in the same idea, same principle. Something else you can do, plyometrics. Plyometrics are simply jumps that you can do without weight. One easy one that you can do, as Travis will show, is just bounding over the top of the hurdle, both feet, coming back and repeating that. You can even set up more hurdles in succession and keep going from one to the next. If you watch, he leaves from his toes, lands on his toes softly. Don't land on your heels with a lot of pressure. Something else he's doing is using both arms. So it's coming from the back, exploding up with what we call an arm block and then cycling back down and through. It's very important. Travis is a high jumper, triple jumper. Helps him get up there to almost seven feet. You can go and alter these also and go one leg at a time to train your different phases of triple jump. It's one of those things to help build up your calves, your glutes or your butt, your hamstrings and your quads. Something else that Travis likes to do is a lot of calf raises. He likes to go ahead and get his calves strong for that explosion up to the top for his jumps. Those are tips on how to jump higher.